We'd like to give you guys a little bit of history on our company and our products. Breakthrough Solvent was originally designed around lumber mills in the Pacific Nor Northwest that were having a hard time with EPA regulations. The biggest thing that they were being hit on was the fact that their parts washers were dumping just horrible amounts of toxic uh, waste into the local environment every time that they, uh, they would use the product. Um, the product then caught the attention of the U.S. military, who noticed how well it was performing under extenuating circumstances, and they wanted this product so bad that they created their own mill specification. Which one is it again, Eric? It's a mill PRF 680C Type 2. Okay. To actually adopt this product. Now, the U.S. military doesn't do that too often. They just create a very wide and ambiguous uh, mill spec rating. They created one specifically just for breakthrough. Um, and the idea was it, it, they wanted a distilled petroleum product, a non-aqueous product, correct? Yes, that's correct. Um, as you may know, aqueous products are not approved by the TACOM Department of the Military, so only distilled petroleum products are, are, are what's used. Okay. Uh, is there a little bit more that you could tell us about this? I know uh, a lot of our customers are giving us great feedback uh, on the use of the product and how it's working on their firearms. But is there is there any information that, given the opportunity, you'd like to give our customers that they probably didn't know? Maybe the chemical composition? Yeah, yes, absolutely. Uh, well, basically, the breakthrough is a distilled petroleum hydrocarbon. Um, through the distillation process, uh, we've been able to remove all the uh, harmful uh, carcinogens, things like benzene, trichloroethylene, uh, chlorine, that are normally um, considered hazardous to humans, uh, sometimes the firearm or the environment, um, they've been literally wiped out from the formula. In doing so, uh, we remove all aromatics and um, rendered an effective cleaning uh, formula that is odorless as well. Uh, a lot of people actually ask about the lack of odor and it doesn't have any, which is a great thing um, and a step away from your grandpa's uh, old solvents. You know, it's funny, uh, it's funny that we bring up that topic. We've been going to a lot more shows this year. 2015 has been very great to us. Thank you again, all of you, for supporting uh, our products and our company. But one thing that we take away from it, this industry has been left wide open for a while, and the the aroma of hoppies uh, is actually one thing that makes people feel nostalgic and at the same time pushes them away from, uh, from firearms maintenance. Um, I just I never knew that there was that much of a connection there between just a, a very harmful, just repugnant odor and people not wanting to clean their farms. I think that's the biggest thing we've seen this year, every show that we've done. Uh, people just very happy with the fact that they can clean these products on their kitchen table and not really need a, a well-ventilated area or an exorbitant amount of PPE that they have to wear. Uh, absolutely. I mean, you could literally um, clean this on your kitchen table. A lot of people have apartments or they don't have a, a garage or a place where, uh, where they can go outside to clean. Um, and uh, Breakthrough offers that. In addition to that, it's uh, very easy on the hands. Uh, you know, uh, a lot of people have uh, skin allergies, things like that. And um, so far, we haven't had any reaction to anyone um, having any kind of uh, adverse effects using the products uh, with, uh, excuse me, without gloves. Um, it's a very safe product. So let me, let me hit on some points just to make sure that we're going down the, the list. Uh, it's a distilled petroleum product. Yes. Okay, non-water base. We'll yes. get to that one in a minute. No odor, safe to use. Is there a shelf life on this product, on the no. solvent? No, um, actually, it's a, it's a good question. Um, basically, since it doesn't work on aromatics, there's nothing that's going to evaporate faster than liquid itself. So it literally, if left on um, uh, sealed, mm -hmm. it'll uh, never expire. Okay, let's go back to the beginning, water base. Why is that such a big deal? Why has the military themselves taken the time, the money, and done the research on going with a straight distilled petroleum product versus something that might be water-based? Uh, well, the answer is pretty simple. Water creates rust. Uh, so okay. if uh, left untreated or not used uh, with extreme uh, caution, um, you're going to start pitting the firearm, you're going to start corroding corroding the firearm and you're going to end up with an ineffective uh, weapon. Um, a distilled petroleum product, uh, especially this particular one, uh, it's a hydrocarbon. Hydrocarbons are pH neutral products. They will not chemically or adversely affect the uh, firearm. Uh, safe to use on all metals. Um, and breakthrough in particular is safe to use on all plastics, rubbers, so on and so forth. 
And um, you guys might have noticed we have kind of a, an assortment of different firearms sitting on the table. Uh, as you see, uh, as we're showing here, a lot of them have different uh, hydro print patterns, Cerakote finishes, uh, different type of KG coat, uh, different materials from polymer to rubber to um, aluminum to plastic. Uh, you're going to see how this product doesn't interfere with the actual composition of these different materials. Well, there you have it, folks. And you know we're always open for more questions. Um, you're going to see at the bottom of the screen best way to reach us. Uh, also, our uh, social media accounts on Facebook and Instagram. Please stay tuned to our website as well, where we're going to be posting some of our videos and customer testimonials as well. That's on the bottom of the screen now as well. Um, I think the best way to sum this up, it's an eco-friendly product for the sake of that's where our technology has allowed us to go. Not for the sake of being trendy. I think that's that's the biggest thing to, to yeah. let our customers know. We will continue to push the envelope on these products. I don't think any time in the near future do we expect to rest on our laurels. Um, you guys are our number one focus. Uh, and please, we, we'd like to see where you would want this company to go next. All right, thanks. Thank you.